What's going on? Average Tech Guy here, and today we are back. More tech, more reviews, and right here in front of us, we got the Astro Pad. Ready? Rock, paper, pencil. So let's talk. All right, so I'm old enough to remember the Jetsons, and when I see Astro pad a dog with a like a space helmet on first thing i think about is the jetsons the dog astro so but this is astro pad it's for the ipad pro and you can get this for your 11 inch as well as your 12 inch since i have the 12 inch model this is what we have so on the front you're going to be greeted with rock paper pencil the issue that i had when i got this was like my male person just like slammed it in the mailbox like they been it the whole thing but there's an extra layer of like foam or paper right there and it didn't get injured so thankfully it was not injured the actual device itself so you got a few different little things in here rock cleaning paper here pencil don't do all that stuff that's their slogan but this is it Astro pad right in here. But before we get into this, you got some more steps over here. You got to take your original tip off, which this is not my original tip. This is a paper like tip. Um, so it makes any surface feel like you're writing on paper. I love it. Uh, you attach their tips. They give you two separate tips and then you put it back on and it looks like there's some stuff down in here. Maybe some stickers. Let's see. And that won't come out. Let's see. Oh, okay, cool. You get some Astro stickers. <laughs> so you do get some stickers. You get two of those in your packaging. And so what I'm going to do now is see if I can get one of these tips out of here. Uh, just like so. There we go. I got a tip. All right, so I'm going to put all this to the side. My iPad actually has a paper light screen protector already on it. So we are going to be peeling that off with hesitancy. <laughs> and there we go. So, okay, Astro Pad, I'm trusting you with my iPad at this point. I just took my paper like cover off. All right. so. I gotta clean this up, make sure we got no like dust and residual dirt left behind. So I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, so got it cleaned up. Now they do not give you any cleaning supplies. So I would say that's like one drawback. You gotta have your own cleaning supplies. And most of the times when we get a screen protector, these companies send out some type of like prep pad or microfiber cloth or something. Uh, thankfully I have that stuff like just laying around. Um, let me see if I can get this tip off of here. All right, this tip coming off, putting new tip on. And I do wanna show you that a new tip basically has like a little ballpoint head on it. So it's supposed to give you a little bit more precision when writing. So we'll do some testing just to see what comes of that. We also want to test to see how this device holds up to a magnetic case like my Zugu, because this is a reusable magnetic paper like screen protector. So keep that in mind. And I'm having a hard time getting it out of here. There we go. Got it out of the packaging. Let's see, is this the magnetic side? This is, all right, okay. There we go. Put it on, lines up pretty well, looks pretty good. It is magnetic. It just stuck right on there. So that is first thing first. Um, next thing is we wanna try out some writing and some tools just to see how this is going to work. So 
Okay. Okay. I like the feel already. Let's see. It did not choose. There we go. Oh, okay. Let's see if you can hear this. I'm going to pick it up. Oh, I like I like the sound. I like the the draw on it. Like I like the actual pull when I'm writing. The drag, it feels like I'm writing with a real pencil. Now, we know that most of these pencils should support the shapes. All right, perfect. Let's scroll up. And now, here comes the big test. Because pressure sensitivity and all that stuff work with the Apple Pencil, tilt recognition work with the Apple Pencil, but is this tip going to be, you know, responsive or no? Let's change up this color so we can see it and straight up and down. Straight up and down. Tilt to the side. It works. Object erase. Let's try another tool. And this brush. Straight up and down, straight up and down. To the side, gets wider, perfect. We like it. Next thing, the pressure. So I'm gonna like barely, ooh, it works. Barely drawing a line, I'm bearing down really hard. Bearing down and barely drawing a line. That's, that's dope. So your pressure sensitivity, tilt recognition, all these features, that typically work with your regular Apple Pencil are also working with this ballpoint pen tip that we have right here. Now, only time will tell how long it's gonna be before this wears out. But one of the better things about this is, is it is magnetic. So if you ever wanna just snatch it up, you can snatch it up, take it off, store it back in here so that it doesn't get dust and dirt and grit all over it, put it back in the whole Astro Pad rock paper pencil packaging i like it it's gonna take some time to see because you know we got to go through a lot more testing but i will be doing an update just to let you know how astro pad is doing over time now my final test is going to be centered around a magnetic case because this is my current case of choice my Zugu case, we know that it's magnetic. And because previously when I had a magnetic screen protector and I had a magnetic casing, when I opened the case, the screen protector would be stuck to the inside sometimes. So my Zugu case, when I open, shut, open, shut, open, shut. Perfect. Does not rise up, does not do anything. Like I haven't had any issues. Looks good. And I rarely take it out of this case, but let's just see. For sake's sake, we take it out and it stays put. So I think it's a really good product. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop a link below so you can check this out for yourself. I have had these uh, magnetic screen protectors before and they didn't quite, quite work out 100% over time. So I will be doing an update probably another month or so just to let you know how this is going to work and I'll also be talking about is this better feeling than my actual you know paper like and with this pen tip I think they really got a winner with this pen tip like it feels <laughs> it's like you're writing on paper 100% you get the sound you get the feel you get the pull when you're writing um I can't say much more I give it an 8 out of 10. Um, now, the only reason I will say it's a drawback is because they don't give you anything in the pack to clean with. And that would be very helpful. Like, give us something in the box to clean our device with. And it's a little hard to get out of this packaging. So, and maybe it's just me. I think it's a good product. Uh, presentation could use some work. I like the box, but, you know, hey, as long as the product is good, <laughs> I'm fine with it. Until next time, hopefully this has been able to help someone out. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.